guys, Logan Bellis here, and today I'm here to give you guys my review for a movie I went to see earlier today, Rampage, starring The Rock, in a monster of movie based on a video game. Now this is a video game adaptation based on a video game that I used to play when I was a kid. So The Rock in this film plays a primatologist who uh, ad uh, adopted uh, this white gorilla named George. A since childhood. After uh, George accidentally touched something that infects him uh, with something that uh, uh, g gave him the ability to grow in strength and speed and agility, uh, we get to see The Rock uh, be on like a mission to save George uh, from not just uh, the other monsters like the wolf and the crocodile that were also mutated uh, to, be, to be very gigantic like uh, George the gorilla was, but to save himself from doing all the like uh, very like significant amount of damage that he would cause to the city of Chicago. Now before I start this review, I want to let y'all know that if you have watched my reactions to the trailers for this film, or specifically the first trailer, you would know how unimpressed I was or with not just the trailer for this movie, but also the, uh, the, that the way they're turning a Rampage, the video game, into a uh, adapting it into a movie, I was very baffled by the fact that they were turning it into a movie. Uh, like, I didn't, like, I don't understand why, for the life of me, they would do that. Because I used to play a Rampage, uh, mostly the Rampage Total Destruction on PS2. I used to play that game many times when I was younger. I, I, I had a blast playing that video game. And the fact that we got a movie based on that video game really uh, made me think this movie is going to suck butt. And <clears throat> it's time for me to eat crow here. This movie was better than I thought it was going to be. Uh, and I'm not joking when I actually say that. This movie uh, pleasant was pleasantly surprising to watch. There were a lot more things I liked about this film uh, than I expected, particularly the relationship between The Rock and uh, the gorilla named George, which obviously is like the main part of the movie, Al although many people were looking at the third act as being like the one part that they wanted to see uh, in the movie, the third act which is basically based on the video game. It, it was very engaging. I really bought into the whole relationship between a man and an ape, uh, or an animal, t uh, typically. Uh, it, it was very, very good. You know, I find myself attaching to both of these characters. Uh, I really found myself investing into both of them. Another positive I will say about Rampage is Jeffrey Dean Morgan. I think that's his last name. Uh, he uh, he did a really good job w with his performance uh, as this cowboy-like agent of some sorts. Uh, there uh, he, th there were some scenes that uh, he appeared in that really either made me smile or made me laugh. Particularly one scene that involves him talking about what his grandpa would say, and, and he was just really good in this film. If The Rock w wasn't in fact in this film, Jeffrey Dean Morgan could easily carry this film with his performance and his acting and his character in this film. His character was just really, really good. And I will say that the crowning jewel of this film, as far as I'm concerned, is the third act of the movie. The third act is what really made people want to go see this movie. Uh, a, a monster brawl type, uh, of some sorts uh, th a movie you know, where monsters get to like, a, a gigantic mutated monsters to like, uh, climb on some buildings and knock them down uh, and just destroying them and uh, sometimes eat people which happens sometimes in this film um i feel like the film respected that part about what uh, about how good the game actually was like this film to a certain extent uh, respected the video game in some aspects uh, particularly uh the um you know a uh, george the wolf and the crocodile, you know, destroying buildings and all that other stuff. Well, it's not really the main focus, but it was kind of a focus in this film. Now let's get into the things that I didn't like about this film. Uh, the girl who played, like, The Rock's partner? I don't, I don't remember her name, but uh, she was a bit, like, more of a, like a, a sit-back uh, type of character. 
you know, allowing the rock to just do whatever he does in this film and just follows him everywhere and just listens to what he had to say. Um, for the most part, she's like that. Uh, and I thought that was disappointing on her, uh, on her part for me personally. Uh, I, uh, they could have done more with her than just having her be on the, a, a back seat uh, to the rock uh, in this film. Just, it was disappointing to see her like that. I will say the story w was really average to say the least. Uh, there's nothing really special about the story. There are some films that I guess have a, a, very, a similar that is a lot like the story in this film. But either way, uh, the story was just relatively average at best. And by far, the biggest negative I have for this film are the main villains in the film. These two villains, no, no, that they're not good in this film. Uh, I really do not like the main villains of the film. They were very weak. Uh, I never liked uh, the uh, the people, uh, the couple that is pretty much brother and sister uh, in this film. I just didn't like the main villains of the film at all. They were very weak and they could have been done better. A lot better. But out of all the negatives, uh, despite the negatives rather, this film was a lot of fun, especially in the third act of the movie. The third act was easily the crowning jewel of Rampage, as far as I'm concerned. The third act gives you nothing but um, uh, fight scenes with with with, uh, uh, with George the gorilla and the wolf and the crocodile, uh, just, uh, just, you know, just things that the video games did. Um, uh, this film kind of did so well at like respecting at what the game a video game does and just does it anyway i guess so and the last fight scene was very good i really enjoyed that last fight scene uh, with george the gorilla the crocodile and the wolf uh, it was very very entertaining and the humor was actually done what very well i find myself to be laughing a lot more than i expected uh, i didn't expect this movie to make me laugh more than i thought it would but it did, so I gotta eat crow on that part. And overall, if I really have to make one sentence just to describe how I felt about the movie overall, it would be, this film was, uh, this film pleasantly surprised me, and I did not expect it to surprise me. It was a lot better than I thought it was going to be, because the trailers made it look awful, uh, the first trailer particularly. Uh, and this film did some of the things... Uh, that respected the video game Rampage, uh, and I thought that was done very well. The Rock, Jeffrey D. Morgan, uh, and everything else was very good. The positives overall outweigh the uh, negatives, as far as I'm concerned. I'm going to give Rampage a Silver Medal of Honor. This was not a great movie by any means, uh, but it was certainly a more entertaining film than I thought. Uh, it was a and it's the second good video game movie, right after Tomb Raider. So that part is really good. This might be the year that video game movies are actually good. So, who knows? We'll just have to look uh, past 2018 to see if uh, this is actually a year where video game movies are actually good. So, <laughs> we'll just have to wait and see. Anyway, guys, that is my review for Rampage, starring The Rock. Um, before I let you guys go, I want to let y'all know that I have uh, that I am on Stardust. Now some of you might have no idea what it actually is. Some of you probably have never heard of Stardust. But, uh, and if you want to know what it is, well let me explain. It's an app that allows you to post your reactions to movies, TV episodes, or even previews. And your boy, Logan, is on there. And I will leave a link to my Stardust account in the description below so that you can go uh, just add me on there and just add your account on there so yeah if you want to be on stardust and you want to follow me follow me on there the link is in the description below so check me out while you're there so anyway guys that is about it for now <laughs> if you guys enjoyed my review please click the like button and comment down below if you have seen this movie and let me know what you think of it if you enjoyed what you've seen here and you want to see future videos from me please press up there to subscribe and turn on the notification bell and i will see you guys in the next video. Have a great week, Battle Squad, and as always, fight the good fight.